宙を僕は片手に持っている震えた君のやる場所へ足を早め向かっているちっと感じ焦る心をせかしただけとどまる気配もなく進んでゆく終わりと始まりの境目Oh hey, welcome to the next episode of how to get a challenger with the help of a plat cuck main. This time I, I will show, show you the, the path, path to becoming the biggest edgelord. After yes fuck off and can I west, and how to single handedly make 6 people DC. I bet you know what I mean by that. He's one of the oldest champions, and went from being a total fuck lord when you built him AP to someone PLS dodge I'm in my promise. He's pretty much the last wuju using person and no, monkeys are not fucking human. Thus, he's got everything needed for the perfect edge recipe. Number one. Having some kind of weird look. Number six. Have blades. A lot. Number fifteen. Have the most tragic past. Preferably something like episode six of Darling and the Fran XX. Anyways, there are three places to tilt off your enemies. You can either go jungling or feed mid or top. But let's be honest here, who gives a shit? Your passive is melee low ocean. After a few basic attacks, you do an extra one that deals 50% damage and applies on hit effects. This thing is your main damage dealer, since the only ability of Yi that actually deals some fucking damage is his Q. Speaking of which, his Q is the shittier version of Fiora's old ultimate. You attack 4 enemies, including minions and stuff, and become untargetable. But that doesn't mean you can't die. I will do alpha! Your W is fuck off Yi can't slam me crack open a cold one with the boys. This thing is just pure and utter bullshit. You regenerate health over 4 seconds, but you also get up to a 70% damage reduction which serves as the perfect boner barricade. Take a look at this bully in its natural habitat. It's pretty simple and boring. Next, his ultimate is. I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. I'm fast as fuck, boy! You get some move speed and attack speed. Come to think of it, why the fuck am I making a guide on a 450 IP champion? Now as for runes, here's the page. All is about that attack speed, since you can exceed the cap with lethal tempo allowing you to have something like 3.87 in the end. Which is the reason why you buy all these blades. Because you can never have enough edge. Never. Never. I might as well give you the ability order here. Attention. A new type of bullshit was introduced to the game making you incredibly broken. For further information stay tuned. So basically this new keystone is just plain out overpowered. For now at least. The reason why it's good on Yi is because of the true damage. Combined with his E you can deal up to 400 true damage per hit. That's the right balance team in a nutshell right there for you. Here's the page, although it's more effective when played on a lane considering you have to mexi in this case. Anyways the items somewhat differ in the two builds, so I'll throw them on the screen. Have you finished yet? As for abilities the order is EQW or QWE depending on the build. Since you is a point and click champion, any kind of hard CC will delete you faster than the FBI finding you after you try to delete your search history. Where are your fingers? FBI, open 
this means you'll have to play like a mere cuck and go in only when you know you can kill all the enemies with your BS 70% CDR after kills. Another very efficient way of getting kills is visiting bot lane and harvesting the finest beans of Rage Mountain. Now then, how do I win with all that gold, you might ask. To which I reply, you probably won't. Seriously, you are playing fucking Master Yi. Go and pick something better if you want to win. Now go and make all the people bleed both online and in real life with all the edge you've gained. A goodbye.